everyone, it's Paige. We are back for another YouTube video today. We are at Puakia in Kauai. We're going to show you the back nine again because that's what this course is known for. I am decked out in my Hawaii gear today, going all tropical and colorful. Uh, but it's been a really awesome trip. Golf courses have been amazing. It's a cute little golf course and I'm excited to show you around. I know we said we were only gonna do the back nine, but pole six here is absolutely beautiful and I couldn't miss it, had to be on the vlog. So it's a downhill, severely downhill par three. There's water front, obviously, bunker behind it, wind's a little up, so you just, I guess, pick a club, hope it's the right one, and execute. So I hit that hill, let's say 10 feet or so. It was around 175 and I hit my seven iron full shot. So luckily picked the right club, but let's just take a second to look at this view. Made my part, but I want you to go back so you can see how far of an elevation drop it is, and then also the water that you actually couldn't see too much from the tee box. So this super pretty hole, and I'm gonna see you on number 13. We're on hole 13. This is a, I would say, a little downhill par three. Really pretty. There's water on the right. Um, looks like it kind of kicks a little bit to the left. So it's 200, a little downwind. So I'm gonna play around like 180, and I'm gonna hit my hybrid. So it's a little bit short and I just just landed on the green. Um, ended up kicking a little bit left. For a lag tie, I'm just focusing in on my speed here. I look like it's going to break a little to the right. It's not a great putt, but uh, we'll try to make the next one. Okay, so I made my par for that terrible lag putt and we're on to 14. It's a par four at 402. Looks like it's crosswind. Uh, bunkered on the right. It looks like there's like trees and stuff that I don't want to be in on the left. Uh, so I'm just gonna go up the right side and hopefully have my little draw and that should be the right play. I have 128 into the screen. The problem is that the angle that I'm at, there's a bunker in front and it's downwind. So I'm gonna go a little right of it just to make sure that I can carry that bunker. I kind of misread the wind on that one. I thought it was a little more down, it's more cross, and when it landed, it didn't kick forward as expected. But I, since I played it smart to the right side, 
I'm gonna have just an easy chip or maybe even a putt and hopefully get my up and down. Okay, so I was significantly shorter than I thought. <laughs> um, it's definitely not a putt, but I'm just gonna chip it on and with some spin, I'm expecting it to hop once and just kind of check up and roll out just slightly. So I'm gonna carry this majority of the way. hole it's definitely tricky because it was a little long but and you had to like hit it in the right spots but it uh it was a fun one for number 16 it's a short par three not much to it it's 114 and a little downwind so i'm gonna hit just a very easy nine iron to control the flight pretty far past it, but I hit the shot, exact shot that I wanted to do. It did well as far as I thought. Um, I just apparently have no depth perception. So I um, have a short putt here for birdie. Not really made many putts this trip, so hopefully I can make this one. Finally, <laughs> made a birdie for the vlog. Um, I like this par three. I think this is my favorite hole of the day. Hole 17 is a 420 yards dog leg left. I'm gonna hit it on the right side of the fairway with my draw and it should be perfect. The wind is not really doing much of anything. It's going to the right. this pin um, the wind was a little bit more in to me than it was to the right uh, so I'm gonna end up going with a punch three wood here uh, I mean this is not a <laughs> shot that I think I'm gonna get that close so I'm just gonna go center of the green hopefully leave myself a good two pop two putt opportunity and get out here with a four too short um, I you can't feel the wind here and um, so I just didn't realize how much it was but it was significantly more into me than I assume and so I'm just gonna have a bunker shot but I'll gonna show you kind of that red clay sand that they have here okay and so as you probably know the color of the sands a little bit different here which can be unique um, most of the time it felt more of like clay and so the way you hit out of that is just have more of a descending blow and really commit to the shot. Here, this actually looks for more like sand. So um, biggest thing is when it's like heavy, just try to really follow through on it and don't get stuck with the ball. Okay, we'll have a long putt to make for par, but we got out and sometimes that's all you can do. with a bogey but it happens and it's golf and sometimes golf really sucks but um, it was a long par four for me I had to hit driver three wood and then um, just didn't hit a really good bunker shot but it happens and we'll hopefully finish off 18 with a birdie since it's a par five okay so this is number 18 it's par five it is 495 a swirly wind so it's been going kind of down and then back in um, I think it's into the wind right now pretty open so I'm there's a bunker left that I could probably get into, but I'm just gonna aim at this tree that's right in front of me and uh, kind of swing, swing away on this one. I think that's perfect. Took a pretty big hop too, so hopefully I can roll on down there and maybe, maybe I can get there in two.
240 into the pin. Um, yeah, I can't get there, so I'm just gonna go up the left side and have a chip up. In a good spot, I'll have a good angle in and probably have around, I don't know, but just like a basic pitch shot up to the green. Okay, so I have 54 yards straight into the wind. Um, green slopes slightly, so I'm gonna go a little left side and have it kick down. This is just a basic pitch shot for me. this vlog today this course is awesome so much fun I'm still not used to playing in these kind of windy conditions compared to Arizona it's just a little bit different but it was so beautiful I hope you enjoyed the scenery and watching some mediocre golf today so <laughs> catch you guys on the next vlog don't forget to like leave a comment and subscribe to my channel